let us learn about earthquakes. What earthquake? A sudden violent shaking of the earth's surface is known as an earthquake. They occur when plates rub along the boundary. When these plates move towards each other, one plate is pushed upwards and other down, creating a tremendous pressure inside the earth's surface. This pressure is released and produces shock waves. These are known as seismic waves. These waves cause an earthquake. The study of earthquakes is known as seismology. The point where the waves spread out is called a focus. Usually, earthquakes are measured with Richter scale. An image of earthquake diagram. These, these are earthquake plates and once one plate is moved towards upwards and another plate moves downwards, creating a pressure inside the earth's surface and causes earthquakes. Let us now learn about the earthquake zones in India. The Himalayan belt is prone to earthquakes. It falls very high risky zones. Kutch in Gujarat and Ganga Brahmaputra Basin are the high risky zones in northern India. Life and property in the country is affected by strong earthquakes. Buildings have collapsed and roads, bridges and communications and railway lines have also damaged. Major earthquakes occurred in Bihar in the year 1988, Uttarkas in 1991, Lato in 1993, Bhuj in 2001, causing a great life on property. Causing a great loss to life and property. Safeguards against earthquakes. Move away from hazardous objects or windows when an earthquake occurs. Hide yourself beneath a table or a desk. If cooking, turn off the heating elements immediately. Do not take elevators when an earthquake occurs. Stay calm and brace yourself. Sitting balance if possible. Keep away from hazardous objects. If driving, stop driving and stay in your vehicle. Do not stop your vehicle near power lines, bridges, overpasses or any potential dangerous locations. Keep a first aid box in your home and school. It can be very useful in case of an emergency. Coping with an earthquake. That means what we can do after an earthquake occurs. Often as mild earthquake can cause injuries to people and damage buildings. We should take several steps that can help to prevent the loss. Be prepared after shocks which may be stronger than the initial jolt. Wear shoes at all the times to avoid stepping on broken glass. Check for structural damage but not enter into a building that shows damage or has visible cracks in the walls of the foundation. Be caution opening cabinets, cupboards and closures in case items may be poisoned to fall. Keep phone lines clear for emergency use. Be patient, it may take hours or days to restore all the services depending upon the severity of the earthquake. Here is an image showing a damaged building after an earthquake. 